So you want to get tickets to see Britney Spears on her 2011 tour? First things first, make sure you sign up for online alerts. You can use Bing, but I like to use my Google account. I simply click on my alerts tab, type in Britney Spears, and I receive a notification whenever any new information is announced. Also, make sure to sign up for email lists and fan clubs in order to get the latest tour news and presale codes. Paid fan clubs will generally get you easier access to seats, so even if there is a membership fee, you'll end up saving money by buying the best seats at face value instead of on the secondary market. Brittany generally uses Ticketmaster's Ticket Exchange for her premium seating. Be careful buying there, as brokers will often have better prices. And for those of you who get overexcited, here's a tip. Save money. Britney Spears tickets sell out fast, so the face value of tickets will usually be around $50 to $300 before fees and memberships. Oh, and make sure you know where your tickets are going on sale for your venue. Sometimes it's Ticketmaster, sometimes it's Live Nation, and sometimes you can get them from the venue's website itself. Always practice buying tickets for a different event at the same venue so you know how their website works. And last, if you get shut out from the on-sale and pre-sales, or the seats are not good enough for you, make sure to check out Zigabit for the best seats and prices. Zigabit, the only site that allows you to negotiate directly with the seller. This has been Zigabit's guide to buying tickets to see Britney Spears.